wrapping up a dresser, what I like to do is place it maybe about six inches from the uh, from, from from the end of the the blanket, and then fold the blanket over. That way, you got some coverage on the bottom. Uh, the bottom is always the part that's going to get nicked. If any if anything's going to get beat up on a move, it's going to be the bottom of the furniture that has the highest highest uh, potential to get to get nicked. So. So, so what you want to do is, is pull it straight out like this. Let it let it fold, fold naturally where, wherever the crease is going to be naturally, and then you have a nice tight. Uh, I'm just going to watch over here. They have a nice tight uh, wrap right there. Same, same thing over here. Just let it fold where it's going to fold naturally. And then come around right here and just hold this. And then you just need one piece of tape uh, to, to wrap it up. What you also can do is put, uh, put some plastic wrap on it so that the door stays shut. Uh, that's one area where I really like to really like to use plastic wrap because it's, uh, it's rather difficult to get the same effect as tape. So we'll go ahead and wrap this up with some plastic wrap. got a nicely tightly wrapped dresser. Now when we move this the uh, the dresser drawers aren't going to come out. So that's nice. You can get the same kind of effect with two or three rubber bands real tight. A little bit harder to do. 